guessed out about this particular code snippet. So it was asked in Paltech interview. Let me run it and show the output. So here, what happens is arrays and objects are stored by reference. So here, the reference to this particular array is stored in A1, and the same reference is given to this A2. But when it comes to A3, a new array is created. Within this new array, A1 is spread. So A3 will have different reference. Now, when we change A1 and A2, this particular array will be changed. But A1 and A2 still remains the same. Here, this zeroth index is assigned with 50, and then the second index is assigned with 80. So both A1 and A2 are these two. And when it comes to A3, it will have this array with fourth index as 100, which means this is the fourth index 100. 